Joining me is the uh, leader of the LSU offensive line, Lloyd Cushenberry. And today, uh, different ball game than the first few, right? This was all about the big boys up front, 50-plus rushes. Yeah, uh, we definitely wanted to come out and set the tone early. Um, you know, our goal was getting 250 rushing yards. I think we, came, I think we came up short, but uh, we definitely, you know, set, came out early. We had a few dips in the road, but uh, we kept, we kept uh, working and got the job done. What, did you was that the game plan all week that you guys knew that hey look we're really going to emphasize the run eat up some clock yeah definitely uh, all year we've been wanting to get more in the run game in our O line room and uh, we definitely just you know just heard heard all the talks that you know we can't run the ball or whatever but uh, we so we just wanted to come out and prove that wrong. Well, you definitely did that. 41 minutes, time of possession. That's incredible. And uh, But how is that different? You know, the tempo was, was you get up to the line quick, but then there was a lot of standing around waiting. Uh, how, was that, how did that help you today? Uh, it helped us a lot. Uh, sometimes, you know, we'll go so fast we can't really uh, get a lot of calls in. So uh, we're definitely on the same page a lot, a lot of times this, uh, this game. And, uh, you know, we wanted to eat up a lot of clock. They had a, a pretty good offense coming in, but our defense did, did a great job and held them to only six points. So... Uh, it was all around a great team win. Didn't see anybody really cramping up there. You know, Texas game, Vandy, you had some cramps. You had, seemed like today was a pretty clean day for you guys. Oh, uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, you know, everybody's been harping on us about, you know, hydrating early and not just the day before. And I uh, feel like a lot of guys, you know, um, did that. And we didn't, like you said, not a lot of cramps. So did a good job this week. Day game, night game, which do you prefer as a player? I, I, I like. I like night games, but I like switching it up, you know, get a little day, day game in. Uh, but, you know, Tiger Stadium is always going to be a great atmosphere, so it really doesn't matter, night or day. I know the fans going to come out and support. Well, you definitely put some tape down. Now teams can't just look at you guys and think, well, they're just going to go hyper fast. You guys are going to do both. That will help you, obviously, moving forward. you got Florida coming up. We know that they always have a good defense. You've been over there the last couple of years. Now you get them at home. Yeah, we're definitely looking forward to that. And, uh, you know, we uh, lost a tough one last year, but uh, we'll be ready for this week. This week. SEC stretch. I mean, you know, from here on out, it's, it's, it's all SEC. I, I know you kind of cut your teeth on the out of conference, but now you're going to get into the heart of it. How do you guys feel from an offensive standpoint? You, you ready for this stretch? It's go time. You know, this will be this will be, we've been waiting on, and uh, time to show everybody, you know, that this offense is for real. We can score against anybody. Good luck uh, next week against the Gators uh, here at the here at the Tiger Stadium. Yes, sir. Thank you. All right, Mr. Cushenberry, one of the leaders of the offense. Let's go back to the studio.